DD Group, Diane James. Commissioner Designate, in the UK, it was expected that overseeing the banker's bonus cap would be the job of Lord Hill, a fellow EU Commissioner Designate. But now we learn that it's been moved to your portfolio of justice, consumers, consumer and agenda. On that basis, three questions, please. Do you acknowledge that restricting bonuses in a globally competitive jobs market <coughs> results in increased salaries? Secondly, do you agree with me that increasing a business's fixed costs increases the chance of it going bust? And finally, in any membership terms regarding renegotiation, would you support requests from the United Kingdom to repatriate the power to keep bureaucrats and the European Court of Justice from interfering in private employment contracts. Thank you. Thank you for the question. First of all, I would like to say uh, that the supervision of uh, bankers' uh, bonuses uh, related to undertaking the risks is uh, quite all right for me. I think that we are going the right way, and I think that we must set the rules in such a way that we prevent moral hazards and in such a way that we uh, prevent uh, uh, taking uh, risks with uh, short-term interests. And we must also uh, prevent uh, any uh, damage to shareholders' uh, rights and, at the end of the day, uh, any damage to the interests of the public. We know uh, that the situation can have impact uh, on the economy in general. Now for the three uh, questions, whether the reduction will lead to uh, reducing wages and whether the companies can uh, go bankrupt or uh, go bust. Uh, I have studied this matter and I have found that uh, the bonus restriction should cover just 1% of the employees. And uh, these are those employees who are in charge of risk investments. So I think that this uh, topic is not that crucial. And as for uh, the, the decision of the European Court of Justice, uh, uh, I'm far from, uh, from judging the European Court of Justice. As you might know, uh, the first hearing took place on September the 8th, and we can expect the final decision until the end of the year. And after that, uh, uh, we will deal with the decision, whatever form it might take. And I am not going to uh, prejudge uh, the content of the decision.